There's a fish. <laughs> All right. All right. Sweet. In the Rio R&D department, we're always striving for the next iteration that's going to make our fly lines perform even better, both for our own fishing and also for anglers worldwide. One thing we felt was vitally important was to increase the life expectancy of a fly line. We also wanted to make the slickest fly line on the market so you can very easily shoot line and feed lines into drifts. Slickcast is the slickest coating we've tested to date in our lab. So how do we know it's the slickest? Let's go to the lab to find out. To test the fly line slickness, we weave a sample of the line through a series of chrome bars. One end is attached to a weight and we pull on the other end to start the line moving and maintain its motion. We measure the forces required throughout the test. The higher the forces required to move the line, the worse it will perform on the water. Here you can see a competitor's line being pulled through our test setup and the resistance is being recorded on the graph in real time. Now a slick cast line is being pulled through the same test setup. We repeat this test multiple times to ensure accurate, repeatable results. And on average, 49% less force is required to move our slick cast line. We have yet to test a slicker fly line sample. To determine a fly line's resistance to cracking, we've developed a proprietary test that replicates the stress that a fly line feels when it's being cast. The test is run until cracks are observed in the fly line, and then the number of cycles that it takes for those cracks to develop is recorded in our testing database. Here we have two samples that have been run to the same number of cycles. On this sample here, we can clearly see the cracks that have started to develop. However, on this sample, there's not a crack to be seen. This yellow sample with no cracks is built using our slick cast coating. To test the toughness of a coating, We've developed another proprietary test that replicates the abrasion that a fly line goes through while being fished. The test is run until small bits of coating start to come off, which is the first sign of abrasion. Here we have samples from two different fly lines that have been run to exactly the same number of cycles. On these two samples, we can clearly see small bits of coating coming off of the fly line, the first sign of abrasion. However, on these two samples, we see no bits of coating, showing that there's a much tougher line. Those two lines were made with our slick cast coating, which, in our lab test, lasts nearly 90,000 cycles longer than our closest competitor. Slick cast represents a radical improvement in fly line technology that allows me to make the smoothest drifts and the longest casts I've ever made. More importantly for me, I know slick cast coating will last for many, many trips to come.